Iran began the burial of one of the country's top nuclear scientists in a cemetery in northern Tehran on Monday, with a senior Iranian official saying an opposition group, as well as the Israeli government, are both suspects over last week's killing of Moshin Fakhrizadeh. Ali Shamkhani, secretary of the Supreme National Security Council of Iran, also told the country's state TV, quote, this is a very complicated assassination that was carried out remotely with electronic devices. That came after Iranian media also reported on Monday that the weapon used in the killing was made in Israel. An unnamed source to the English language station Press TV claimed fragments from the site where Fakhrizadeh was killed bear the logo and specifications of the Israeli military. In Jerusalem, there was no immediate reply from Israeli officials contacted for a comment on the report. Fakhrizadeh was killed when his car was ambushed in a spray of gunfire on a highway near Tehran on Friday. One Iranian outlet attributed it to a machine gun operated by remote control, while another said it was a weapon controlled by satellite. Israeli intelligence minister Eli Cohen told a local radio station before this latest press TV report that he did not know who was responsible.